Okay, for this video, I'm going to show you the original flipbook that I did in this class. Um, this is the project that I'm going to take for my final project and do another one or redo. Um, so, first of all, my first um, kind of idea for the flipbook was I wanted a lot of movement, so I thought, why not twirl my baton? I could have the baton going in and out of the frame, and so it would create a lot of interesting levels. Um, so that's what I did. I took a video of me twirling the baton and I got on the computer and I took many stills from it, maybe like 200 stills. And then I realized that it was actually a lot of pictures. So I deleted every other one so it wouldn't make the, the book so thick and you could still tell exactly what was going on. And so that's what I did. I went on to Photoshop. I resized uh, all the images to um, five by three or three by five and um, and I made it black and white so that's that I printed it out on cardstock because the regular printer paper was just too flimsy for what I wanted to accomplish I actually did print it out on printer paper first and all the pages were sticking together it wasn't really showing every single page so I went up to cardstock um, I use screws to bind it together. It holds it together very nicely. Um, it doesn't, you know, move around or fall apart, say, as tape would do, or maybe even glue. So I use the screws, and I'm going to show you what it is. That's all.